I don't know where we're going today. He's just riding around for a little bit. With my brother. He hungry. Damn right. Looking for a woman who looks fact, too. I know where we can go. Keep straight. I ain't even damn that. Shout out to the women who cook. Hit me up. Say it again. Shout out to the ladies that can cook. All right. Hit me up. All you cooking ass ladies. I got a good job. I'm loyal. I'm funny. All that. Hit him up. And he's single. All you gotta do is feed a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> We are on Massachusetts Street. This is the post Tribune. We'll slow down. This is where we're going. Matter of fact, just pull over and put your blinkers on. <clears throat> you get up. I guess that's a yes. Now we're not going to spend too much time out here because it's raining. All right. My buddies at the Steel City Storm Channel already explored the inside of this building, so I'll leave you a link to that video. But uh, right now, I want to talk about the railroad, because people swear that they don't remember there used to be some railroad tracks that come across here to serve the side of this damn uh, post Tribune building around here. And the evidence for that track is right here. You know what I'm saying? So the tracks, the siding for post viewing came off from back here. It used to be a switch back there. And it came across this way. Okay. And uh, the tracks came across this way. And trains used to park right here. You see all the traffic backed up over there. Obama is here today. So it's a lot more traffic on Broadway than what it usually is. But trains used to park right here on the side. Huh? It's still real over here? Wow. Oh, yeah. It is still real here. Yep, here's the other rail over here. So the rails are still here at the Post of Dunes. There you go. This siding for the railroad is still here at the Post Tribune building, blocked by this giant pile of debris here. So this is the loading dock. I haven't seen any photographs of any trains uh, here at the Post Tribune. I might have to look for them. If I can find them, I'll put it in a video for you. Like, wow, I didn't know the damn tracks were still here. All right. <sighs> Would have spent more time out there if it wasn't raining. All right, so right now we're still on Massachusetts Street. That's the Save More grocery store. This is the old Wabash 4th District right here. Now, back before uh, this street was put here, like this street is relatively new. I believe sometime in the mid 50s, uh, Massachusetts Street actually went through the uh, embankment over there. Uh, but before that, all of this belonged to Wabash Railroad. And the Wabash Railroad had a freight depot that sat back here. And you can still see evidence of tracks that used to cross the street here, especially back here. You can see where tracks used to be with that line right there. And there used to be some more tracks that came across this way. All right. And that was the location of the freight depot. And back here was a stub yard. Back here in these weeds was a stub yard. Uh, one way in, one way out, kind of railroad yard. I'm gonna uh, put some pictures in this video for you so you can see it. But the Wabash had a freight depot back here, and 
just so get close up on these lines for you. You can see where the tracks used to cross the street here. I will see you guys later. Like, share, and subscribe.